D-Trap here playing a little domination on Modern Warfare 3, the map's carbon. In this video I'm going to discuss rage quitting and how I feel it is the worst aspect of online play. Out of bugs, glitches, exploits, cookie cutter specs with weapon and perk choices which make it easy to play online because I feel there's nothing worse than when a high quality tier player deserts his team because things aren't going his or her way and when I mean when they're not going when things aren't going their way it's usually got to do with KD ratio I'm running the L86 primary, right shield, secondary obviously to do so I've got the overkill perk in the second tier I feel like I can't run overkill without specialists so I'm running that too I'm just going to show pretty much snippets of the battle between me and Insane Phase. He's the uh, the guy that uh, rage quits. Uh, he does get a really really good start, especially thanks to me. You see that here, he gets me first uh, right off the bat. I drop my attack insert. He's right there just after I drop it, so he killed me for a third time. He'll get me again here with a Pred missile. Um, I'm running Blind Eye Pro, so he calls in his helicopter. I'm going to shoot that down straight away, make use of my Pro perk. I get picked off here, and I take a really good look at the scoreboard. I'm 0 and 5. This is an excellent opportunity for me to quit the game. I'm not going too well. My KD, in a sense, isn't looking that good. He's is. So he's setting himself up for a really good game. I'm going to try and stay in and recover. It's good in a sense that you might be a fairly decent player in the game, but when things aren't going your way, or some guys on the other team's got your number, you decide to uh, pull out, and I think it gets into a, a psychological habit where you'll only play games that you either know you'll do well in, which is just, I feel beyond a joke. I mean, it just gets to a stage where you're pretty much letting the team down and as much as you get frustrated at your own teammates, I think you quitting is a hell of a lot worse than people on your side getting farmed because if you feel that your frustration is coming from the point where you're better than your teammates but it totally erases that notion when you decide to rage quit, that makes it a lot worse. If you are carrying the team and you quit, that makes you no better than the teammates on your side that are getting absolutely annihilated. I think when this obsession begins, it makes the game too serious and wanting to beast all the time really, really takes the fun out of the game. There is nothing more exciting than when there's competition than when there's an actual challenge and there's decent players on another side or when it's a really 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 close game even though you might end up you might not end up with a, a great KD and you might lose even by a big margin I feel the game is at its funnest point when there's a, when there's a challenge just gonna wrap the video up here end up picking up Juggernaut from a care package and cap the remaining C flag thanks for listening Who's pretty good at sniping?